Hello everyone, this is Andy aka Volts of Extorth, as per usual with an arcade block unboxing which I have here. Before I do that though, I want to quickly mention this is the new issue of Zero Tolerance magazine. Go get it because it has Fornius in it. Uh, we're on the cover CD. Um, we've also got a review. Three, three out of five. Yeah. Not, not too bad. I mean, let down by long. Like people apparently don't like 25-minute long songs, but it's pretty on point. But never mind. That's besides the point. You want to talk to me about Fornius? Go and find me on Twitter at Vaults of Extoth. If you want to watch uh, me open an arcade block, it's time for that. Um, time to open this with a small pen knife. Uh, and I'm going to cut towards Trot, which is roughly that direction. Whoop! There we go. So, you may have noticed there's no Nerd Block or Nerd Block Junior this month. That's because my uh, subscription ran out. So, um, uh, so instead of the Nerd Block Junior, you've got the um, the Gadget Show vlog and stuff. Hopefully, by this point, if I can get it to render, um, it's being a dick at the minute. I know I'm not supposed to swear in these ones, but. Never mind. Um, and the nerd block ones I, I might replace with sci fi block. So we'll see over the coming months what replaces what. I'll probably still collect arcade block though. Anyway, enough babbling. Let's look what's in this one. Um, this is the. Uh, what month is it? April. So this is the March one, I believe. So whoop. Let's have a look. What is the shirt? It looks like it is. It's Donkey Kong Deadpool. So it's like a Donkey Kong level. But let me let me come to the camera and show you. There's Donkey Kong, but then there's a little Deadpool there. Like wandering around going like boo doo 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 doo. And he's collecting like ingredients for a chimichanga, I guess. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, I got, oh my god. Um, we've had Monster Factory plushies before. Slime. This is one of Mega Man. Look at his face. He's like, <laughs> my god, you are one ugly Mega Man. Oh well. He's very scary. He can sit over there. Uh, what else have I got? I've got uh, what looks like Pokemon nesting dolls. Let us have a look here. So we've got like a Charizard type face. Another Charizard type face. Oh, right, so, so I'm guessing that's Mega Charizard Evolution, that's Charizard Evolution, that's Charmeleon, that one's Charmander, and there's a little, oh, Charmeleon, Charmander, go in there, there's a little Pokeball, oh, and inside there's nothing, so let's put those back together, um, on there. This one is, I'll sort it out properly in a bit. There we go. Can go there. And fair enough. I mean, we've had the Guardians of the Galaxy uh, nesting dolls um, in the what was it? The the normal block. Normal node block. Ooh, what the heck is this? Uh, an exclusive Nemesis figure from Resident Evil. I didn't play. Ooh, I didn't play much uh, Resident Evil, but I've got to tell you, this dude looks pretty fucking cool. Look at him. He's like, let me. I should just hold the camera here. Look. He's like, look at me, bear. Look, that's pretty awesome. Well, he's definitely going on my desk, and he's got a little 20th anniversary sticker on his 
on his base. So, he's going on my desk. So, that's that. And what else have we got? We've got another exclusive Just Cause 3. Uh, this is an arcade block exclusive as well. If I can get it out of the box, then I'll be able to show it you. On the side, it says Grapple Hook Memo Clip. Well, we got the little card that says Just Cause 3. Ah, there we go. Finally. my quote from earlier? Oh, I remember. Time to open this with a small pen knife. I'm not sure if it's the thing I ordered. Etc, etc. Ross wrapping. Well, this is a weird looking thing. It's like... So it's a fist with a little hook. I'll come back to the camera and show you. I'll, I don't play Just Cause 3, but I'll probably keep this on the desk for just God knows what else I'll do it with it. It is a little fist, a little punchy fist with the hook, and the grappling hook has this little bit, so you can actually put notes in it. That's uh, pretty cool. I'd probably appreciate it more if I played Just Cause 3. Um, as it stands, I currently don't, but it's a game that I could always look into in the future. <coughs> I think um, I think Mike might play it. Um, maybe. I don't know. Um, one thing I'd like in here, now that I've finally got into uh, gaming again, is, um, as you can tell by the, pretty much all the rest of the videos on this channel, is uh, stuff to do with uh, the Telltale games or like um, Elite Dangerous or something. But we'll sure see. So, what we got? Resident Evil 3 figure, Nemesis. Yep, the Pokemon nesting dolls. Um, so yeah, it was the Charmander Evolution, Mega Man Push Toy, Just Cause 3 Grapple Hook, Marvel Deadpool video game shirt. And then next month, we have items from Zelda, again, Assassin's Creed, and uh, Borderlands, and uh, that, uh, the, this is the April block that's coming up, and the April block also has three exclusives in, so, hmm. yeah, um, all in all, pretty cool, I mean, not as attractive to me as the previous ones, but then again, it's like, when it's about games, I've not really played It's like, um, I've not really played the Resident Evil games. If I'd have played that, the nostalgia would have kicked in and I would have been like, Oh my god, this is the greatest thing ever! But I never played Resident Evil, I'll be honest. It's like uh, Final Fantasy stuff. I only ever played Final Fantasy VIII and got like part way through and gave up. Um, my most fam the the things I'm most familiar about with Final Fantasy is watching Spoonies reviews. Uh, so yeah, just cause three I've not played Mega Man. I've not played Pokemon. I played. Uh, I've not played the new one with the Mega Evolutions, but um, I remember playing like uh, a horrible crap copy of Pokemon Red, and um, I got Pokemon Silver. I had a level 100 Tyranitar that I hand trained. I was proud of that dude. Like, whenever I went into a battle, it was just like, Tyranitar, dead, 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 dead. <laughs> it's like, I'd just stick him at the front and then he'd just win anything. And it's like, if I needed money, I'd just be like, Elite Four, Tyranitar, kill everything, kill everything. It's basically like, turning up, like, if on the show, um, Ash had gone to the Elite Four and like, Oh, what are you gonna do, puny little boy? And he's like, I summon Godzilla! What? <laughs> it was basically that. Or, uh, to compare to another thing that I've referenced before in the flashback series, it's kind of like 
um, in Yu-Gi-Oh! when they turn up and they're like, Oh, how are you going to defeat my blue eyes right dragon? Egyptian god card! <laughs> you know. So, like that. Anyway, um, I'm going to leave you guys to it. Oh! Um, once, uh, one thing I'm going to mention here is, um, I know me and Connor just only do the nerd blocks at the minute. So, um, one thing I've decided we're going to try out is, um, me and him do a lot of, like, co-op messing around on stuff like Goat Simulator and, uh, Minecraft. So, um, we might actually start recording some of our messing around, just to see if anyone, if anyone fancies watching it. Um, if you think this is... That would be cool. Just leave a comment below. Uh, I mean, if not, we're going to try it anyway, just so you can see what it's like. If it's if it's cool, we'll keep doing it. If Connor doesn't get bored, <laughs> we'll keep doing it. If not, then whatever. The only thing is, obviously, because we're playing split screen on the same console, the footage will all be split screen. So you'll have one half of the screen be Connor and one half of the screen be me. Um, obviously, I'll just put like little tags as to who is who on which side of the screen. I mean, it'd be easy enough in Minecraft because it says, but Goat Simulator, I don't think it does. Um, I don't know. Anyway, I'll uh, leave you guys to it and we'll see what next month's arcade block brings. So until then, bye! I have developed a cold! Oh, by the way, Zero Tolerance Audio CD looks like this. And let me show you the um, page. Before we go, this is the Zero Tolerance magazine in question. The camera's just being like, this faces! And then inside, this is the CD. And over there, Fordius. <laughs> How cool is that? Anyway, I'll stop waffling. Bye!